Hi everyone! We have some visual brainstorms, the Smart Thinking Game. It's by ThinkFun and has a hundred cards. That means on each card there's one challenge. So that means there's a hundred challenges in each box. It says right here you can play from ranging ages 10 to adult. You can also play this with multiple players or with one single player. Let's see what's on the back. The difficulty challenges are arranged in easy, hard, and very hard. Each card includes a bonus question. So that means there are 100 bonus questions in each box. Let's look inside. Each box comes with a set of instructions. So if you have any more questions, you can read this. Let's look at some examples. As you can tell, these also have faces to tell you what what challenge level they are. This is easy, hard, and this is extra hard. Let's show you what they say. Puppy pondering. As little Bucky looks at himself in the mirror, which of the four reflections illustrated is the one he will see? I'll give you a moment to look. Okay. If you figured it out or if you are stumped, let's look at the answer. It says, the correct reflection is illustrated below. It was that one, shown there. They also, when you see an eyeball in the front, it means it has a visual bonus. You do not turn the card over when you're already reading it. Bonus, at what hour and minute was little Bucky enjoying his reflection? I'll give you a moment. Then let's look at the answer. The answer is upside down on the bottom of the card. Answer, he was enjoying his reflection at 1110. Let's go to the next one. Bacon and eggs. Lauren's latest entrepreneurial venture is raising Vietnamese potbelly pigs and ostriches for fun and profit. Among her animals, she has 17 heads and 56 legs in all. How many pigs and how many ostriches does Lauren have? I'll give you a moment. Now when you're stumped and you don't know what, what it is, we can look at the answer. And if you got it right, that's good. Answer. Lauren has 11 pigs and 6 ostriches. Here's how. Each animal has 2 hind legs, so 17 heads means 34 hind legs total. The remaining 22 legs must be the front legs of 11 four-legged pigs. Therefore, 11 heads belong to the pigs, and the remaining six heads belong to the ostriches. As you can tell, this card does not come with a picture. Not all cards come with pictures. Bonus. This is not a visual bonus. It's also just a question. The ostrich lays the largest egg of any living bird, 6.8 inches long by 5.4 inches wide. What flying bird lays the largest egg? It is A, the California condor, B, the mute swan, or C, the wandering albatross. I'll give you a second. Okay, let's look at the answer. The wandering albatross, about 5.7 by 3.5, and followed by the mute swan, 4.5 by 2.9, and all the California condor, 4.3 by 2.6 inches. Now that we're done with this one, let's look at the very hard one. Pattern match. The, this flat pattern can easily fold into an oct uh, drawn when fo folded together this way. Will there be one continuous snake from head to tail or not? You can tell there's a visual bonus. Yes, there will be one continuous snake. Coral snake, scarlet king snake. As you can tell, this is a picture here. Visual bonus. Do not turn card over. Bonus. What was the snake illustrated on the octahedron, a non-poisonous scarlet king snake, or the highly po poisonous coral snake? I'll give you a second. The answer is... The highly poisonous coral snake. That was the end of those. So let's look at some. Let's look at what the rest of the deck looks like. There are pictures, and they show their their faces and the challenges. Also, you can tell that they're easier to find with the backs because they're more colored. You know that the red is extra hard or very hard, blue is hard, and green is easy. Well, I hope you guys liked this video, and. If you did, please like and please don't forget to subscribe. Bye!